less fun. This is exactly how it feels like to be in the Philippines. Learn all about the rich culture of Pinoy. Discover the wonderful flavors of Filipino cuisine. And get inspired and be in awe as we show you the magnificent sights from all corners of Luzon, Visayas, and Mindanao. He's Stefano. And she's Selene. Brace yourself for a whole new season of fun and adventure. Pabiyahe na ang... Pinas! In the heart of Resorts World Manila, a world-class stage that has been the home of many great performances reside. What is this place? Let's watch this. Welcome to Resorts World. We're here this morning with Mr. Owen Kamaya, the Director of Communications, Corporate Communications here at Resorts World. Magandang umaga. Good morning, Stefano. Good morning. How are you? I'm good. Uh, I'm glad you're here. <laughs> what can people do here at Resorts World? Well, a lot. A lot of things. Yeah. So Resorts World Manila is an integrated resort. So meaning it's like a cruise ship on land. Yes. So we have here retail here. Mm -hmm. We're in the mall we're right we're now. <laughs> yeah. We have over 50 dining outlets, F&B. Wow, right? that's a lot of choices. Yeah, we have uh, different And different budgets than yeah. yeah. Yeah, so there's from entry level, mid, business, luxury. Wow. So completo yan. Completo. Right? We have uh, MICE. So meetings, meet incentives, centers, yes. uh, conferences, exhibits. We launched it last year, the Marriott Grand Ballroom. So it's, it's the largest ballroom here in the Philippines. It's the largest in the Philippines. Yes, so wow. it, it can accommodate 4,000 uh, people. That's a huge yeah. ballroom. Yes, 4,000 people. <laughs> and huge so. banquet operations. Yeah. Uh, of course, we have world-class entertainment. Yes, we have gaming, entertainment. And then different hotels as well. You different have, hotels. You have the Marriott, you have Maxims. Belmont and uh, Remington. Do these hotels cater to different price yes. points as well? In yes, different target similar markets? to the uh, dining outlets. So mm -hmm. entry, mid, uh, business, and luxury. So para sa lahat talaga? Para sa lahat. So, so holistic. Holistic tayo. Holistic tayo. <laughs> That's good. Now I'm curious about, uh, of course, Resorts World is also known for entertainment, yep. meaning the performing arts. Tell us something about the Newport uh, Performing Arts Theater. It's ano, eh, one of our ano, eh, uh, advocacies talaga, to champion the Filipino talent. And one channel is uh, through performing arts. And so, you also do a lot of Broadway shows here. Yes, a lot of Broadway shows. In fact, uh, that's part of our advocacy, right? Mm -hmm. To promote the Philippine talent. And uh, by doing so, we produce uh, world-class uh, shows like Chaos. Oh, you also produce it yes. here? Okay. Uh, Chaos, uh, Cinderella. Uh, we have uh, Between Walang Ning Ning, Priscilla. Yes, I've seen that oh, one. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I know. It's, it's a, a great show. It's the first of its kind, right? From yep. comics. Uh, it's an original Tagalog. Uh, to the movie. Story. Yeah, yep. to the movie and then to, to the theater. To the theater. It, was a, it was a great, great show. Yeah. So aside from Annie, um, of course, Annie is a well-known children's musical. Mm -hmm. What else have you had for, uh, for future shows? Uh, right now, it's, it's Annie. It's Annie right, first. Right. You're heavily promoting that Yes, one. yes. We're really excited. It's a timeless classic. Uh, it's the first time that I've experienced so much uh, inquiry. The last production of Annie here in the Philippines was Panahon Pani Lea Salonga. Lea Salonga, yeah. So that was the last time and this is, a, this is why it's I, such I think, a great production. Just to be accurate, uh, the last major production of mm -hmm. Annie here in the Philippines was you know, in the 80s. Back, back with, in the 80s, yeah, yes. Yeah, with, with Lea Salonga. So, uh, so, Leia's been here. She's very supportive of. Uh, I'm sure Annie. she's gonna watch that. Yeah, she's <laughs> she's always visiting the the rehearsals with mm -hmm. the kids. If you want to invite everyone to come here to Resorts World, um, now is the chance to invite them. Oh sure. How can they find you if you have, if you have social media accounts? Okay. Uh, uh, to all your televiewers and uh, your fans, uh, I'd like to invite everyone uh, to come visit Resorts World Manila. Uh, we're here in Newport City in Pasay.
With so many things to do in Solaire, we can definitely indulge ourselves with the many recreational activities it offers. What makes people go back to this luxurious resort? Watch this. You know, we, we take luxury very, very seriously here. Uh, we're 800 rooms, we're two separate towers. One tower is entirely all suite, there's Sky Studios and above. And the other tower, which was originally here, is 488 rooms and suites. Everything we do here is luxury. Of all our restaurants, we have a total of 15. We like to really look at three specific ones that we call our signature restaurants, so to speak. Uh, Finestra, Red Lantern, as well as Yakumi, our Japanese restaurant. And to be honest, personally, the Yakumi restaurant is my favorite. All the, f all the fish is flown in fresh all the way from Tsukiji Fish Market in Tokyo. There's a lot of places to drink and a lot of places to really enjoy the property during the day and during the night. They're very different times of day also. Personally, we have one location called Oasis. Oasis is an indoor-outdoor concept. It's indoor, but it's under a greenhouse glass. So you feel like you're outdoors, but you get to be indoors. Great place for tea, great place for an early evening dinner drink. As you transition into the evening, there's two of the best bars in the area. There's Eclipse, which is a little more livelier. We have live music every single night, an array of cocktails, and actually the best bartender in all of Manila was actually just voted here last month. Amenity-wise, the property has so much to offer. It's really difficult for me to sit here and just talk about one or two. But one thing that really sets us apart from other hotels and other venues as a whole is our Sky Range. We have a luxury gun range that was purposely designed only for Solaire. We took an entire floor of a car park here at Solaire and designed a luxury gun range just for those enthusiasts and to be different. There's no other luxury resort in the world that will have something like that. Solaire is very much open for events, and we do it all. We do indoor, outdoor, we do restaurant buyouts, we do small corporate events, we do small meetings and functions, and we do dinners and, and weddings up to 800. I'm inviting everyone personally to come visit us here at Solaire Resort and Casino. So much to offer right at your doorstep. I hope to see you here. The world's most recognized Japanese restaurant is here in the Philippines. Let's head to Nobu Restaurant in City of Dreams to check it out. The Nobu Restaurant here in Manila is affiliated with the world-class, uh, internationally acclaimed Nobu Hotel which is the first hotel in Asia. Uh, we are a 335-pack restaurant. We are serving the same signature dishes that you would find in other Nobu restaurants that are located around the world. So it's a Japanese-Peruvian cuisine. It's a contemporary fine dining restaurant uh, with uh, Japanese aesthetics that run throughout the restaurant. We've got several signature dishes. Amongst my favorite is the black cod miso.
Well, the feedback that we get is fantastic. Those who are familiar with the Nobu restaurant tend to dine here because of the signature dishes that they've been acclimated to over the years when they've dined at other Nobu restaurants around the world. They enjoy it, the fact that we have a great proximity, uh, the fact that they can come to the hotel, they can make an event of it in a sense where we've got world-class gaming, we've got facilities for children, great hotel rooms, and several other dining outlets available. The concept with the Nobu restaurant originated from Chef Nobu, who had gained his experience by being a sushi chef in uh, Tokyo, Japan. From there, he had experience in Peru as well as in Argentina. And he then was able to cultivate this cuisine, this Japanese Peruvian cuisine, which then catapulted him to create the Nobu restaurant, along with the internationally acclaimed actor Robert De Niro and Hollywood film producer Mayor Tepper. Uh, from there, they've been able to grow the restaurant uh, beyond 35 restaurants that are located across five continents. Within the Nobu restaurant, uh, we've got two private dining rooms, uh, tempanyaki tables, in which we have two of, sushi tables, and we've got floating cabanas. So our restaurant, which consists of 335 seats, can accommodate guests both indoors as well as outdoors. So for our guests wanting to dine alfresco, it's a great ambiance to do so. Well, we're very fortunate enough to have the David Rockwell Group out of New York to design the interiors for the Nobu restaurant here in Manila. Uh, they are responsible for bringing the Japanese aesthetics to the restaurant and allowing us to be able to fulfill the, uh, the dining experience that Chef Nobu would like for us to provide to his guests. We encourage you to visit the Nobu restaurant. Uh, we are open daily, of course. Trippinas would like to thank To Go Travel, Toyota, Carmudi, Bose, Fifi Hotel and Beach Resort in Morong, Bataan, and Fifi View and Breakfast in Tagaytay. Who says Entertainment City is just for adults? Kids, great news! City of Dreams has this all-new interactive entertainment concept where your favorite characters play with you. Dreamplay is an interactive play space derived from DreamWorks, and it centers around the famous movie characters such as Shrek, Madagascar, and Kung Fu Panda. Children that are 79 centimeters and below are complimentary, while those who are above 80 or 10 years and above are 680 pesos during the week and 880 pesos during the weekend. Um, please be mindful that rubber shoes and socks are required to enjoy the 12 plus attractions located here at Dreamplay. We have a variety of activities that are interactive as well as digital that are great for both kids of all ages and adults alike. The activities consist of obstacle courses, climbing walls, as well as an animation studio that children could design their own film for. We 
we've got Shay Jinji, a restaurant, three function rooms, great for birthday parties, and both, uh, what well, the Dream Play is great for corporate activities and team building, as well as family day functions. We have just implemented an annual pass that's 4,900 pesos net, which includes a variety of discounts, including express check-in and where you can avoid the lines or queues as well, in addition to food and beverage discounts at Shea Jinji. The feedback that we've received in the past has been absolutely fantastic. Not only do the children like it, but our corporate clients enjoy it as well. Dreamplay we find that has been wonderful for corporate team building as well as family day events. Well, we have three great function rooms, great for birthday parties and alike. We do encourage uh, families to come out and celebrate their special occasions. We've got three great function rooms that can accommodate up to 120 people. I invite everybody to come out to Dream Play. On the weekends, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, the hours are from 9 a.m. to 10 p.m., while Monday through Thursday, the hours are 10 a.m. to 9 p.m. Come and join us, have your pictures taken with uh, characters such as Shrek, Madagascar, and Kung Fu Panda, and we invite everybody to engage and interact with the Dream Play uh, interactive play space. Flash to my body, I danced and swayed.